Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to All Things Melody. And today I'm going to be doing Unpopular Opinions Fashion Edition. If you press this link, th that means that you want to hear my opinion. So these are my opinions. That's it. So, I've been seeing a lot of stuff. Like, not just lately, like all the time. People do this over and over and over, all these things. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's horrible. So I might say a couple of good things, but like it's horrible. I wrote it down. Yeah. Okay, we'll see, but <sighs> yeah. Anyways, I wrote it down. So first, my unpopular opinion. I hate girls that wear dresses with sneakers. Like a t-shirt dress, okay, cool, that's fine. But they would really have on like a whole like sundress and then put some ones on. And it's like, why are you doing that? And then they, and then because they have on a dress, your feet looks mad long. You just look crazy. Like, why are you wearing a dress with that? Uh, like, and then, yo, too, dresses with skirts sometimes too. Like, girls will wear that whole bodycon skirt with those chunky Balenciagas. And then they feet just look like rocks. And then it's like, why? Like, there was other options, I'm pretty sure. But whatever. Not even whatever. Stop. <laughs> like, stop doing that. Anyways, so. Okay. Second unpopular opinion is biker shorts. I really think that biker shorts are really cute. I see a lot of people be like, oh, biker shorts are ugly and they shouldn't be worn, they should be burned. I think that they're actually cute. I actually have on biker shorts right now. You can't see, but I do. But I feel like. I know why they saying that because like the females really be wearing out the biker shorts like every single where they go they wearing some biker shorts there's other things that you could wear other than biker shorts it's mad comfortable and it's saying you're trying to show that you have this whole comfy laid-back style but there's other things that's comfy in shorts that's not jean shorts because people think that's not comfy but there's other things that's not comfy i mean there's other things that's comfy so Stop wearing out the biker shorts, but I think that they are cute. Just stop wearing it so much everywhere you go. Third, so there's this reflective bodysuit that I be seeing um girls wearing. It's like they have different colors. They have black, pink, green, and put the picture. But they have black, green, pink, um, and then it has like some reflective thing. Like yo, you turn off the light, they look like flipping. <laughs> Stick men, what is it called? A stick person, something like that. You don't have to light in the reflect, yo. Stop wearing that outside. Cause if we outside and it's dark and somebody put on a flash, they're seeing you. Like you look like a stick person. Stop. A lot of boys, some girls do this too, but like they wear sneakers with no socks. Why do you do that? Like, I really want to know, why do you do that? I'm pretty sure that everybody knows, like, you're supposed to wear socks. Your feet probably stink now because you're not trying to wear no socks. Why not wear socks, though? Like, I really want to know what's the big thing about not wearing socks. Have you seen boys be wearing, like, high top, I went to a high top, low top sneakers with, um, no socks. And it's like, where's your socks, sir? And then sometimes they have on the ones and then they lace is not tied. And still no socks. Like, oh, this is just horrible. <sighs> I gotta cut it out. See, y'all killing me. I'm out of breath. I'm only on number, like, four. Because all oh, this is just horrible. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Next five. This irritates me. And it's crazy because all y'all girls do it. Y'all be outside with the Nike Pro biker shorts. No, not biker shorts. The Nike Pro, like, chair shorts or something. With, like crop tops and really no crop tops y'all don't wear like no regular shirt no nothing i just be outside crop top with the nike pro shorts why like if you're trying to just show your body or something you i don't know like to me that's just a stay in the house outfit why am i wearing a crop top with white shorts outside that's just doing too much you look retarded those are chair shorts exercise shorts you walking around you at a party with these shorts on it's like you had nothing else to wear. Like, the shorts is like $25. You could have got something else. I don't understand why y'all do that. That really irritates me. Number six. This was like, I don't know if it passed, because I haven't really been seen a lot, but it's the flipping 
bulletproof vest that the boys is wearing the things it says icon like it's a plastic vest or something or kind i don't know but all i know is that it's not saving you from nobody you have no ops that's more and i'm pretty sure that even if you did that's not saving you why are you wearing that you look retarded like you're not a cop not nobody you had a party wearing a bulletproof vest that like lights up or something like who, who i wouldn't know who started that trend that trend had to had to start like down south or something because and they really brought it here and whoever was in brooklyn wearing that crazy if you wore it don't do it again if you was thinking about wearing it and you're a boy girls too but i haven't seen a girl in it but if you was thinking about wearing it don't do it that's not it that's not true at all okay next this is another trend that i've been seeing i know it's quarantine i haven't been to a party in a minute but boys really be popping out to parties with dirty ups on why i understand like if you outside you're doing your business you're like okay i'm outside whatever but then you come to a party with the dirty ups for what you expected people to think he was fly i don't care what you have on what you have on dirty ups i'm gonna look at your feet first dirty ups that is horrible why did you come here okay next boys in crop tops i know this was like a little wave that passed i'm happy that it passed because the boys was looking retarded i know that like they was like will smith did it in um that show fresh prince and someone else had did it but like y'all other boys y'all look retarded y'all really walking around with crop tops some straight jeans a book bag like that was not it i'm happy that era passed so bad because i used to be scrolling and seeing it and i'm like please don't don't do that you know them shorts with your butt out like i know that some people the shorts like for me sometimes i buy shorts my butt is not meant to be out but then it comes out and then i know be seeing people talking about like oh if you wear shorts with your butt out you're a thought i feel like that's not true i feel like that's cute because sometimes it just happens and if you feel like shorts with your butt out is not cute you probably have no butt or your butt is like nasty and ugly because who don't like to wear shorts with your butt out like i'm not talking about your whole butt out <laughs> wait i'm not talking about your whole butt out like just a little cheek yeah just like your butt cheek a little bit i just feel like that's fine it's summer you outside get lit whatever if you don't agree your butt flat done next next color okay i honestly believe that ripped jeans are better than regular jeans almost all my jeans are ripped like i remember when i used to work and stuff and then they would be like <laughs> you have to wear like plain blue jeans plain black jeans i'll be sitting here like i don't have that honey i have to go get it like and then when i'm done with the job i would then like not wear jeans i work in or donate it or something because i can't like ripped jeans is for me ripped jeans is it the rib stretch jeans, you just, it looks fire. Rib jeans with any outfit is fire. If you disagree, I don't know, you boring. Cause I haven't seen people talk about rib jeans, it's not for everything. Rib jeans is for everything, sis, period. If you don't believe so, then something's just wrong for you. You literally wear rib jeans anywhere. I got 12, so I mean I'm going kind of fast. Okay, whatever okay next is cross branding that's like mixing the brands like wearing a adidas sweatsuit with some air maxes or you know i feel like that's horrible because i don't know why do people do that i see like no purpose like if you're gonna wear a whole adidas sweatsuit you could have really got the shoe because if you was buying a nike shoe i don't get it a nike sweatsuit nike shoe adidas sweatsuit adidas shoe i was saying people wearing feel eyes but that's not it so we're not so adidas adidas nike nike anything i mean if it doesn't have like the logo or the logo is not big i would say okay sure whatever if it matches but people be wearing a whole adidas sweatsuit sweater with the whole with the three stripes with a nike sweats and then some air maxes and then it's like why did you put on the sweater y'all need to really cut this out like <laughs> These that I'm talking about, I know that a lot of y'all do this, 
and y'all hearing me and y'all thinking to yourself like damn is she safe right now she come for me yes i'm coming for you cut it out we're not even done like we have so much more to talk about just me and you we're talking about this right here right now because these people need to cut it out so what's next oh all black is not out people will get some flipping the most colorful shoe in the world and put on all black i don't understand why like i understand that all black itself is okay but then you throw in a colorful shoe and then you just have the all black outfit no color no jacket accessories nothing like well i can't think of no really colorful shoe but like let's say for instance the red toe ones it's red black and white so people might think like, oh, I'm putting some black jeans with a black shirt and a black jacket and I'm lit. Like, no, that's not a fire outfit. They have me really think y'all dripping with that. I can't. I can't. All designer is not drip. Just because you put on a flipping Gucci shirt with some Mary jeans and some Balenciaga sneakers, then you got an off-white belt. And some Cartier glasses. Because for y'all boys, y'all know y'all like to wear out the Cartier glasses. That doesn't mean that you're drippy. You could look retarded, crazy. You're crossing all these brands. And not one thing goes together. Not one thing matches. Or even you look mad basic. Like, you look like you're an H&M. Only thing that you have on you that looks different is the brand name. Like, that's not drip. And y'all be buying out that stuff. Y'all be ruining it. The, the people who actually know how to, like pop out with it don't even want to get it no more because like you ruined it they don't even want us to be associated with someone with the clothes no more because you wore it that hard like stop thinking that because you have an older design in your dream it doesn't matter why am i only talking about boys girls too girls would then do that like they would have like the little the pink palm angels bag but then a yellow i don't know <laughs> But then a yellow shirt and then a pink skirt and then blue shoes and then it's like you look crazy you look like a clown none of this goes together and then someone else got on like a little fashion over set but then they accessorized it well with the color and the shoes and the bag and the hair is nice and they look better than you. you're mad you just spent a k on an outfit and somebody outfit not her whole outfit, because like I know people like to do with the shoes, but the top which just looks way better than you. And everybody likes their outfit better than yours. You just spend bread for what? To look bad. All designer does not equate to drip. That's it. You ruined it. I don't know if this has to do with fashion, but I feel like it still equates because it's like your appearance in a sense. It's them huge lashes. Like, my lashes right now, they're really small. I know that. I wear bigger lashes than this sometimes. But never like those fluffy lashes. Girls really be one of those Ari lashes. and But they have a tiny eye. It don't even look good on her all the time either. Like, they, they eye look like this. Like, you can't even open your eye. It's mad heavy. I don't understand why girls wear those heavy lashes. Why do you do that to yourself? Because even with these lashes sometimes, I be getting tired of holding. I'm like, I need to take it off. And y'all really like, yo... Y'all look like this. Like y'all about to fly away with these huge lashes. Like all that lash for what? Do you even stick on your face? Cause I know all them lashes has to bend and stuff. I don't know. Another unpopular fashion opinion. I don't know if this one is really fashion either, but I know a lot of people do it and it pisses me off because it messes with me. It's when people like they bulk shop, like say a sneaker comes out, they buy 10 of the same sneaker to sell it for like three times the price. Like why? You don't think that I want the shoe and I want to pay the same price you did? Like I haven't seen you trying to make a profit but like three times the price? Y'all really be old with the price. Cause like mad shoes I want to get. Cause like I feel like the shoes that's coming out now, like later, is not cute. A lot of old shoes that already came out I want to get it. But it's like y'all be selling it for like four or five times the price. I don't know what profit y'all really making because imagine if you sold the lower, more people would have bought it. And y'all be selling for this high price and y'all not making no profit. Even so, stop doing that. Let me buy the shoe from the company because I want it. Oh, another unpopular opinion. The Gucci belt with the two G's, ugly, horrible. I don't know who started that. I mean, at first... No, that's more of a classy look, I guess. But I would prefer a, like a Hermes belt or something. Like the Gucci belt is not it for me. And boys really be trying to wear it to pop out. 
that's not really a pop out thing i don't know i wonder if it's cheaper if that's why the boys be getting that. i should have i should have dead googled it before this video so i could have had something to say because y'all probably is buying it because it's cheap but i don't know <laughs> but that gucci bro with the g uh-uh next unpopular fashion opinion I know my girls, y'all know, like when we shop at like pretty little thing, fashion over, sometimes it sends you like a dress or a, maybe a skirt, something like tight fitted and it has that cheap material that has like the lines. I hate that so much. When I order some, first of all, if I even order something that has that, not even, if I even order something, I like zoom in to look at the material because I really don't like it. And if I somehow miss it and they send it has that material, I'm sending it back. But people really be wearing that. I feel like that material just looks so cheap. Like, it gives me pretty girl vibes. Like, the it just looks very cheap. Like, oh, I paid $5. Not saying there's something wrong with paying $5, but, like, you can't look like you paid $5. It looks horrible. I hate that material. It is so cheap. Off-white belts. The off-white belt, the the one that I like caution tape. <laughs> that it does. But people really think that because they put this on their outfit, that they... It's somehow drippy, somehow fire. Like, girls will really wear a whole, you can see again, all black bodysuit. But then they put the off-white belt around their waist. And then they think that they have the most fire fit. And they post like, oh, you can't drip like this. Like, you're wearing a fashionable bodysuit with an off-white belt and some regular sneakers. There's no accessories, no color scheme, no nothing that's going on. I don't get it. Like, that's not drippy. I don't know the whole off-white belt trend i feel like sometimes once in a blue it's worn properly but i feel like it people need to stop buying it so the next unpopular opinion for fashion trends is bucket hats okay i feel like when it was here it was pretty you know lit or whatever but i feel like that's really a trend that should not have been started because one night i was in my closet cleaning i see my bucket hats like to me they were not really cute like on me at all I don't know where I was wearing those to, where I was going, but I feel like I should not have worn a bucket hat. <sighs> our next unpopular opinion that I really don't like is girls who do not wear their size, especially the bigger girls. Like, they'll have one like a crop top. I understand, like, if you're bigger, okay, cool. But sometimes, like, when your stomach, even me, sometimes, like, my stomach looks a little bigger. So I'm like, okay, I'm not gonna wear a crop top today. I feel like everybody should have that talk with themselves like should i wear this or no and sometimes you really have to tell yourself no you need to wear your size people be wearing a medium they get an extra small all the extra smalls is sold out they're on instagram looking like they wearing their little sister clothes you need to wear your size boys too like boys too boys will have on sweats and then their sweats look like leggings or they will have on like bull shorts and the bull shorts look like pom pom shorts it's like, where are you going? This is not your size. You need a bigger size. Even with the whole when boys wear jeans and then it's high waters. And I know it's not on purpose all the time. Some boys really be wearing high waters. <sighs> Why are you wearing high waters? It's not that hard to get new jeans. Because this is the whole thing about drip. Some people would really rather wear like something that can't even fit them. Just so that they could save to get something more expensive of one. That makes absolute. Why not do that one? <laughs> but one. That makes absolutely no sense. Drip is not. Same thing I said. It's not just designer. Wear your size. Okay. Next. Black ups. I hate black ups so much. I don't know why people do this. You look like you about to go rob a bank. And then they be creased. How do you crease black ups? Where are you wearing them so much that they get creased and messed up? And people, some people really be having the audacity to get the high top black ups. That is like the most horrible thing you could ever do. Like we know you robbing a bank later. We just know. We see what got that stuff, the high top black ups. It's clip. We know where you're going. You're going to the bank to rob. Some people, I'm not gonna lie, some people dead ass um, wear it well. That's a once in a blue thing though. Like, and it don't even really be black ups. Most of the time we custom black ups. So yes, these plain black ups, high top, low top, whatever, throw them away. Please, no more. Next, unpopular opinion, cuffed jeans. I really hate people that don't cuff their jeans. I feel like you're always supposed to cuff your jeans. With every sneaker, especially when you wear sneakers, even with sandals, for girls too, cuff your jeans. 
you need to cuff your jeans. When you not when your jeans aren't cuffed, it really looks stupid. And then the jean like in the back of the jeans, I don't know if people really look, but like when you don't cuff your jeans and in the back of the jeans, it has like a weird oval like thing to me. I hate when it, when like the the back tab. I don't know what that thing is called. The back of it. I'm doing messed up with my fingers. I hate when my jeans cover the back of it. So that's how I prefer to cuff my jeans. And I feel like it just makes the outfit. You have on something, you cuff it. I feel like the outfit is made. Like you cuff your jeans. Next. Okay. I hate straight baggy jeans on boys like the jeans is just straight down it don't even look like your jeans but the waist fits so it's confusing like you need to get fitted jeans if because i know some boys don't like skinny jeans not all boys like skinny jeans but fitted jeans is amazing it works wonders fitted jeans versus straight jeans straight jeans it have your outfit like a two skinny jeans it'll have your outfit or fitted have your outfit like a ten that's for boys now sometimes for girls straight jeans dead look fire i'm not gonna lie like mom jeans and stuff it dead looks nice but for boys no stop with the straight jeans toms on boys i don't know i don't know if i keep coming for the boys but toms stop the toms on the boys do not look good so first of all most of y'all boys be mad skinny they all have the toms y'all feet look like boats y'all be walking mad hard y'all just look dumb that was short, I know. Okay, thank you guys for listening to my Unpopular Opinions Fashion Edition. Remember that these are my opinions. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe right now. Turn on your post notifications if you want to get notified every time I post a new video. You did it? You did it? Okay. Okay, good. Alright, we'll see you next time. Alright, bye. Bye.